Hey, what's up? My name is Cameron, for those who don't know me. And I just wanted to hop on here and say that your value doesn't change. Your worth doesn't decrease based off of somebody else's selection. For example, say you go out to eat and the waiter offers you three different options. A cheeseburger, a steak, and a rare blue lobster. Now the waiter is telling you all of the benefits and amazing things about the blue lobster, really trying to sell it to you. But you decide, uh, I want the cheeseburger. Now by picking the cheeseburger, did the value of the blue lobster go down at all? No. Did the worth of the blue lobster go down at all? No, it just wasn't picked. It wasn't selected by that person. But the next one could be a whole different story. That's the point I'm trying to make that your value, your worth doesn't change based off of somebody else's selection. That's why being planted and cemented in the word of God is so important. And you knowing you are who God says you are, not who this world says you are, not who people say you are, because they will determine things based off of things that are here today, but gone tomorrow. But God's word will last forever. So when these situations come to you and you are putting yourself out there, but you're not selected, it may hurt, it may still suck, but you know who you are. So therefore you do this right here and you just keep going. So if I can encourage anyone who's watching this video right now, this world might say that you're scarred, but God says you're healed. Isaiah 53, five. People may say that you're weak, but God says that you're strong. Psalms 18, 32. The world will hold sins above your head, but God says those sins are forgiven. 1 John 2, 12. People will abandon you. God says, I have adopted you. Ephesians 1, 5. The world will say you're too broken. God says, I have made you whole. Colossians 2:10. People will leave you, but God says, I'm always here with you. Joshua 1, 9. Your value, your worth does not go away based off of somebody else's selection. Once you know your identity in Christ, you cannot be shaken. Thanks for watching. Stay inspired.